Welcome back to the channel where we simplify technology for you. For this particular video, I will show you the new feature of Google Docs which is, which is called the timer. This allows you to set a timer for yourself while you're working in a document. This is helpful for you staying on track and meeting deadlines. So maybe you're thinking, what is the use of the timer in Google Docs? Well, there are several ways. I'll just mention some few, few uh, things on how to use the timer. While you are writing on a paper or a project, you may want to set a goal for how much time you want to spend writing your paper or a project. And then after that, let's say you're in a hurry and you don't have much time because you have a lot of things to do, you may want to set how much time you want to proofread your work, okay? So because before you submit it, you have to proofread your work. And the most important thing is that if you've been working for long hours sitting down, you have to take a break, okay? When taking a break, you have to make sure that you stand up so to avoid eye strain and to improve your productivity. So this is some of the items that, uh, some of the use of timer in Google Docs. So maybe you're wondering how to use the timer. So first, there are two options. You can use the menu or you can use the at sign and then you type the word timer. So from the menu, you click insert and then select smart chips, look for the timer and then you can set a time. Or as I mentioned, type at sign and then timer, then you press enter and then you can set the time. So let me demonstrate how to use it, okay? So let's go to Google Docs and let me show you how to access this, the timer. So you, to access the timer, just click on insert and then go to smart chips and then you go to timer. And you can see there's also stopwatch, okay? So maybe if you're a teacher, you want to give uh, a guidance for your students. Okay, you can write only for 15 minutes, so you can do that also. So let's go back here. For the timer, you just click the timer and then let's say you want to work for 15 minutes only. So you type five, one five and then zero zero and then you can click the play button and it will start counting. Okay, that's the first one using the menu. Or to use the timer in another way, just type at sign and then timer and you will see the timer. You, so you can select from all these options. Let's say you want to take a five minute break, just click on five minute timer and you will see that you can now move your mouse pointer there, hover your mouse pointer on the five minutes so you can see the play button and it will start counting. So that these are some of the use of a timer in Google Docs. I hope you liked this video. If you have any questions or comments, just um, type them down in the comment box and give it a like if you like this video. Bye for now.